All right, what's up, mga Kanoy P? Um, so, day one of me doing a prop firm challenge using the strategy that I tested. So, for context purposes, uh, ito yung back testing results ko so far. Um, for forward testing. Starting capital of 1,000. My win rate at the moment is 42.11% with 95 trades. I started August 21st with a max losing streak of 8 consecutive trades. And currently is up 17.5%. Um, ito yung ngayon, kasalukuyan. Uh, my profit goal here is to make 100,000 to 8,000 for how long it takes. So, ito na yung dalawang trades na pinasok ko today. Uh, papakita ko lang kung ano yung itsura niya sa charts. So, again, this is C Trader. As you can see, I am on a live account here for this brokerage. And this is my total uh, realized PNL at $103.64. That's um, what I did. So, ngayon, uh, the strategy is really, really simple. At opening of the market, of New York market, um, I will wait for a candle break of whatever that is. Kung yan man ay below or above the 5 minute opening range. So if I uh, click this, may nyo, this is 1330, which is this candle was the opening candle of the 5 minute time frame. Uh, dyan sa session na to. So, ngayon, kung makikita nyo, uh, let me just highlight it. No? Kung makikita nyo dito, this is the closing candle of the 5-minute time frame. So, once mag-close yan, the idea is, and it doesn't work all the time, right? Nakita nyo naman yung win rate ko, 42%. Uh, it doesn't work all the time. So, idea here is to uh, enter the trade at retest of this line which is technically the close of the opening range right not not the close pero yung tip ng opening candle right to get there here yeah to get there retest of that i entered my trade in there this is new s30 and i placed my stop loss here okay tapos the idea is as much as you can get at least one is to two uh, uh risk to reward ratio okay so kaya may kita natin dito um almost one percent or more than one percent a little bit uh, and then this one's also more than two percent Right. I risk 100 to get 200 and it's really just what it is uh, ang idea ko dito that's why I'm creating this series is the importance of backtest right? sa, sa backtesting na results natin pinagdaanan ko yung 8 consecutive losses kita natin dyan, right? Uh it's the same idea I only trade 3 assets uh, US 30, S&P 500, and the UK 100. Sa ano naman yun? Sa, sa New York, o, eh, sa UK Open naman yun. Right? So, this is day one. Uh, Paulit-ulit lang natin itong gagawin. Uh, I may lose 8 consecutive uh, trades again. But if that happens to me, hindi pa rin ako mawawala dito sa prop firm challenge and all because my risk is only 1% of my total max drawdown. My total max drawdown is $10,000. Even if this is a $100,000 account, um, the idea is for me to uh, continuously fulfill the same strategy, follow the same rules, 
nothing else. And I'll just set it and forget it and then let it run. Let your system run. And like I said, ito nga yung importansya ng pagbabacktest. Uh, it will help you add to your confidence when you go on a live account. At makikita nyo naman sa backtesting results ko, I started August 21. August 21. See, this is the start. August 21. And I, I'm barely 100 trades. But right now, August to October 21st. That's three months. Three months. Right? Ganon kahirap mag-backtest. Ganon kaboring mag-backtest. But if you're planning to be in this business for the long haul, then I strongly, strongly suggest that you do and backtest your strategies. Alright? So, yun lang naman mga kanoy P. When I get the day 2, which is going to be tomorrow, upload ko siya ulit dito. Uh, and hopefully, you drop down your questions uh, and hopefully I can help out to reach people uh, that's, uh, that are aspiring traders to not be negligent of their back testing uh, and forward testing approach. No? Tingnan natin. I don't know ako ano mangyayari. Will I blow this account up? If I blow this account up, I will need a lot a lot of losing streaks and we'll see if that happens okay so yun lang mga kanoy P see you on day 2